Hello 大家好，我名叫 Sam， 咁我今日講解一隻股票就係周大福，佢嘅股票號碼一九二九啦。咁佢哋就係賣嗰啲誒金銀珠寶嘅，同埋係喺誒大陸同香港係開咗好多分店。咁就誒、呃，首先睇翻呢間公司 Industry Score 咧 ，Overall 咧係值八十九 percent 啦 ，out of 一百，咁係好過個 Industry 五十七 percent 嘅。Recently 咧個 Industry Score 咧係七十 percent 啦，嗯係好過個 Industry 大嘅四十九 percent 嘅。咁你睇翻 industry score breakdown 咧，誒佢個 growth rate 幾高分啦 ，profitability 又幾好啦，七十五同埋個 efficiency 又唔錯嘅，係唯獨個 cash flow 好似低咗啲。咁不如我哋睇一睇個 cash flow。咁 in terms of cash flow 咧，呢間公司咧，你係會見到咧，誒、呃、嗰、那個 free cash flow 係上落都幾犀利嘅。嗯、um, ，and 喺嗰個 free cash flow to sales 咧，你會見到咧。喺二零一一年同二零一二年咧係負嘅，咁喺嗰個 free cash flow to net income 咧，喺二零一一年咧同二零一二都係負，同埋係得四年係得 ，sorry 係得一年係好過嗰個 industry average。So overall 我覺得唔係 in terms of cash flow 唔係咁好咯，而我覺得作為睇一間公司係好定唔好啦，我最緊要就係個 cash flow。一 cash flow 係先會 determine 到一間公司係咪真係賺到錢嘅。咁我睇一間呢間公司嘅價值啦。睇翻呢間公司嘅價值咧，你會見到呢個 assumption for 呢個 growth rate 咧，大概係三百二十九 percent 啦。咁係非常之高嘅。咁點解會咁高咧？就因為佢我呢個 spreadsheet 咧，就係用咗二零零九年當佢冇嘢變成佢三二零一三有有失變三點一三嘅，三點二九嘅。咁就係會 overestimate 咗呢個 company 啦 ，of course。咁不如我哋而家誒 adjust 翻呢個 growth rate。咁喺二零一二同二零一三年嘅 growth rate 大概係講緊十四 percent 嘅。咁而家個 market 咧，大部分諗緊佢咧就係 grow 緊大概十六 percent 嘅。咁不如我哋試下十六點八五 percent 睇下得唔得？不如試下十六 percent， 呢個就係個 market 覺得佢 grow 幾多嘅。好啦。咁、那個 market 咧，其實覺得佢 grow 十六 percent， 但我自己認為咧，呢、這、一個 growth rate 咧都係會講叫做幾進取嘅，因為你見到個 curve 咧都係 curve 得好上。如果我哋做一個 prediction 咧，我哋儘量係唔可以咁進取嘅，覺得一間公司係係升到好似 curve 咁上，我哋應該係用個保守啲嘅方法去 estimate 一間公司，就係、是、based on 一個 linear upper growth 嘅。咁而家我哋就要 adjust 翻呢一個 growth 啦。大概而家我慢慢 adjust 翻咧，十四 percent 咧，咁你會見到一條線仲有少少斜上去嘅，咁我哋再保守啲咧，就十三 percent， 都係有少少斜上去，不如用十二 percent 啦，咁差唔多啦，咁可能咧呢間公司咧，誒、呃、應該係大概九百個八蚊五毫五嘅，但係呢間公司咧，因為周達福呢呢個公司都係有名嘅，咁所以咧可能呢間公司係值十個幾嘅。So overall recap 翻我哋講關於周大福就係佢嘅業績咧，咁多年嚟咧係唔錯啦。Overall recently 都唔錯，係為到佢個 cash flow 要咗啲。但係佢呢間公司咧，佢哋嗰個 valuation 其實已經係大概已經差唔多到價噶啦。So 係啦，多謝大家收睇 ，thank you。Actually sorry sorry， 我而家睇一睇翻啦，我有啲嘢要 make adjustments。Um, 你會見到嗰個 dividend per share 咧，係用 average of five five years 嘅。咁呢度 average of five years 就唔係好 accurate 啦。咁我不如用翻呢度嘅 average 啊，大概零點一六。即係我覺得呢咁多年嚟，呢十年咧，佢都會用收到零點一六嘅息嘅。哦，咁嗰個變化都唔係咁大。So anyhow， 就應該值大概十一十二蚊啦。好多謝大家收睇。